All right, so I've got a nice little uh, bone dry porcelain tumbler. And uh, what I'm gonna do is paint a little, little tiny calcifer. So I've got an Amico, um, I guess an LUG one. And then I've got a bunch of the Velvet series under glazes. So here's another Amico V series. This is a V391. This is a intense yellow. Bright orange, which is the V390. And then of course, here's the bright red, which is V387. I've got a little dish of water right here so I can clean off my brush. Um, I want it to be relatively thin. I'm just going for a first layer. I just want to coat that yellow on. Definitely don't be afraid to rotate your paint surface in order to get the, the line work that you want. I'm just going to clean my brush. orange is a lot thicker. I'm going to get my paint palette open and what I'll do is I'll just mix mix some of this orange with some water. So, a little bit of water in there. So I'm only going to load up the brush right there at that tip. out my brush. Definitely need to clean out my palette. Get this oxide out of there. Alright, so now we're gonna go for some of that red. So I'm gonna just dry off my brush. Got a very small amount of red um, over here, but I think it's gonna work out just fine because I don't want to put too much. Okay, so we're in the home stretch right now. I'm gonna clean off my brush. And then now what I need to do is to think about where can I apply a little bit of line work. So I'm getting just a tiny bit of underglaze on that brush. And what I'll do is I'll, I'll start by doing the pupils because I want a lot of this to come off of the brush. So now that I got a very sharp edge right here, And I think we're all done. And in about a maybe in a week or so, I'm gonna I'm gonna fire this guy. And then what I'm gonna do is do a clear glaze on the outside. And then on the inside, I'm gonna just pour like a bright yellow. So that'll kind of match the color that we have out here. All right. Thanks for watching.